tool you can your reporting tool is capable enough to connect to various sources so discover does not offer this so connect to various sources without the need of uh, etl solution that's one important discover was a dump it was a dump query tool dump query tool it does not have a intelligence incorporated so that it can decide on its own which query is optimum so obi is capable enough to identify or or prepare create optimum query able to identify or create optimum query traditional reporting tools like a blind they just create they just create a query and throw to the database they do not know the respective query is optimum or not whereas bi reporting tool like obi they are intelligent enough to identify the given query uh, is optimum or are we able to use underlying data source capabilities the rich feature some of the rich feature comes out of this it's a complete web based solution therefore it's a zero footprint client zero footprint client therefore you do not require as a business user you do not require to install any component any plugin to uh, browse or to navigate your business data it is completely web based so zero footprint client complete web based solution second thing is a common sense and intuitive now there are two kind of inform there are two ways to supply the information to the user push technology information supply uh push push technology by which a report bursting is one example and pull what push technology it means rather than user come to a reporting tool and navigate the data what we do we create a report and push the report to the user desktop or the user machine okay so bursting means let's say we have got monthly closing report and we have got there are 1000 consumer for this what we want first business day we want this report to be thrown to the user desktop so push technology it means intuitive it could be intuitive as well intuitive it means the report should be capable enough to sense if something happen so i ap apply some trigger my trigger says if my sales is less than average sales for last 12 month rolling this is my business criteria or my business criteria if if sales is less than target by 50% inform to the user to the stakeholder i cannot all the time monitor it as a user that what is my sales so we apply certain business cases <coughs> which all the time monitoring and based on the event it push to the user so it the one example could be common busting where monthly closing report or quarterly closing report or monthly sales report revenue report hiring report various reports are pushed to the users automatically or certain based on certain event or pull where user connect you connect to the site user visit to the source reporting source either you go and get the report or the the system should be capable enough to uh either should be capable enough to you know 
throw the information to your local desktop, your mobile desktop, whatever means you use. And these days mobile communication, there are new components that are added to OBI as well for mobile based communication as well. So the, this point is discuss the same thing, common sense and intuitive user interface. All the time there is a myth, there has always been a myth. People who do not have exposure to the database technology working, it is they assume like reporting tool contributes great in terms of performance. So it is a myth, I wanted to highlight in the first slide itself. People say, uh, I am migrating from XYZ reporting tool to my OBI and I found in the same database. I found the performance gain of 100%. So they, it is subject to certain areas. It is myth to assume OBI can improve the performance. Improving performance depends upon optimal data source. A major area of training is always, I always want to highlight that query performance is greatly depends upon I say 70% of query performance depends upon underlying database design. Thirty percent reporting tool can contribute. So you tool you use any tool in the world if your database model is not designed correctly, if there is furious join, Cartesian join, your statistics are not collected, your index are not properly designed, your data model is not in such a way that it support the query. Your no reporting tool can help you out, right? So, reporting tool can contribute only 30% of performance. As a reporting tool developer, what I can ensure that I am going to use a correct SQL query. I cannot take care of if your statistics are not correct, your index are dropped, you have garbage data in your database. As a reporting developer, I cannot ensure all these things. So we are responsible for 30% of performance of reporting tool from query creation point of view, server memory management, optimum, query creation uh, and Server memory uses whatever mechanism my server uses to memory manage, we can ensure that. Or reporting infrastructure related as an OBI administrator. These things we can manage. The first step uh, when we suggest a solution to the client, the first step we always ask to the user to design the model in a way that it supports my reporting solution which again depends upon which database solution you are using. If you are using Oracle, SQL Server, DB2, they generally prefer to have a star schema model whereas if you work in Teradata, they, they work directly on the non-star schema model because their underlying way of processing the query is different. So in order to create a query reporting solution we also need to assess what is my data source? Accordingly, we design, define our strategy. So OBI can contribute in terms of performance by ensuring that you design most optimum and intelligent query. You make use of your server resources optimally and you do not hit your database unnecessarily. This is all we can manage from reporting server point of view. Okay, there are certain highlights terms I'm going to discuss about. See, reporting requirements are very vast. I can design report for my transactional system. Maybe I'm creating a report for Walmart. Now, if you see, Walmart has a high volume of data. Similarly, if you're creating report for telecommunication domain, they generally have very huge volume of data. So, if you're designing transactional report, you're designing data warehousing based report, BI report, you're designing ad hoc reporting. So, you're first part of your analysis, you understand the nature of report you are designing. OBI is designed to address enterprise-wide data. 
enterprise wide means we do not create a departmental solution we create 